so we're a weird aspiration, and um, to us, this quality meant that um, to have an aim, uh, to have passion, will, and drive, and basically the future, because you need to aspire to become something, to do something, it's your actions. Um, mm. Examples we can see in political life, they've stolen Maggie Thatcher. Um, we also thought about, um, if you think about Nelson Mandela, and yeah. you could also bring in recently um, 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 Barack Obama, yeah. because he had the aspiration to actually push himself and go that extra mile. Um, how do we feel when we encounter, encounter somebody who exhibits this quality? Um, to be honest, it's, we feel quite privileged and we feel inspired uh, because mm -hmm. they have that determination, they have that drive. And because when you meet with them mm -hmm. and you socialise with them, then you, they, you know, it's kind of like, it's oh. contagious to be honest. That's mm -hmm. great, yeah. Um, how does it feel when you exhibit this quality? Me personally, I feel proud of myself. I think everybody else would as well. Um, when, you know, if you want to aspire, you you feel determined and you actually want to, you know, go that extra bit so you achieve something and progress. And um, the last question, why is it important to develop this quality in political life? Um, the main reason is because in politics, as Mr. Berko said downstairs, it's not like business. Um, it's, it can get quite dirty and a lot of people can knock you down. And if you don't keep aspiring, you don't hold your dreams tight, then you might not always progress. And you need that aspiration to get where you want to in life. Thank you. Mm,